Hello, 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 time is to roll. Welcome, 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 babies. If you're new here, welcome back. If you are returning, come on in. Get your shit, get your shit, get your shit, and get comfortable. Because we about to make it do what it do, moms, okay? The smoke detector will beep, the planes will fly, I sing, I curse. If any of this is a problem, now would be the best time for you to click off. If not, come on in, honey, stay a while, like, subscribe, comment, share. All my info is down below in the description box. We're going to jump into this divine connection read here. And if you're new here, because they always seem to come out like a soap opera, we call this segment as the tarot turns, okay? So we'll see what's going on with our divine connection today. What do you need to know? What is the overall energy? Twin flame, twin ray, high level soulmates, divine life partners. Life partners. Well, somebody being stubborn ass shit. Do y'all see these cards? Do not want to go together? Stubborn asses. Don't be stubborn. Okay, that's it right there, y'all. Name of the mother, the father, the son, and the Holy Spirit. Divine connections. What are we talking about today, Spirit? Are we doing any to jump? Divine connections. Okay, Six of Swords. Someone is heading towards happiness here, moving away from emotional conflict, moving towards something peaceful. Someone may have to travel across a body of water to get to you. Someone may live near some mountains here that overlook a water ocean here what else is going on for our divine connection huh. somebody is leaving this karmic headed toward their happiness and this queen of cups in reverse is angry as shit when I say this is a mean spiteful angry bitch right now man or woman yeah they are angry and spiteful right now because someone is moving away from them moving towards happiness moving towards peace could be dealing with a pisces cancer scorpio but this karmic is stressed the hell out right now they can't eat they can't sleep they all in their feelings they all in their emotions Give me one more spirit, divine connections. Yeah, see, they don't want, they don't want this divine masculine to leave. They want him to return. They don't want them to walk away. So they're trying whatever they can to keep this divine masculine from leaving them. Can I find this Queen of Cups in reverse, divine connections? Knight of Wands. Yeah, so they could be trying to offer them sex, a good time. To get them back in to their good graces here. That's why the Nine of Swords. Yeah, but this Divine Masculine is blocking it. Divine Masculine don't want the sex. They cool on this karmic. And this is what's causing this karmic, this anxiety, this fear. Because normally in the past, sex worked. Normally in the past, this, this person could use sex and this person would come back. They would return. But they're not. They're some type of lying, sneaky, deceptive. Somebody got caught with some type of lying, sneaky, deceptive. Clarify the Six of Swords, the Eight of Cups in Reverse, Divine Connections, the Hermit. Yeah, so your person walked away and they're by themselves right now. They're in Hermit mode. Okay, they could be healing from whoever this karmic is, but I don't feel like they're talking to you and they're not talking to this karmic either. Clarify this Knight of Wands and the Queen of Cups in reverse. Yeah, and now this, this karmic is stuck all up in their head. They're caught in fear. They're in this self-imposed prison. Because what happened in the past is not working now. What worked in the past is not working now. 
Nine of Swords, the Two of Swords. Yeah, the King of Cups. The King of Cups is walking away from this King Queen of Cups in reverse. And they're angry. They are blocking this connection. And they're staying to themselves. Divine connections. Divine connections. What's going on with this karmic energy? They are afraid because it's not working. And this divine masculine is staying the fuck away from them, which is not normal. No, normally, this divine masculine returns. Clarify the Six of Swords for the karmic care spirit. Seduction. I told you. They usually use seduction, attraction, teasing, hooking up. The third party temptation. To get this, this divine masculine. And it's no longer working. Yeah, this, this karmic could have some type of addictions. They're codependent. They're obsessive. They're restrained. They're possessive. They're controlling. They're dealing with a bunch of emotional blocks. And this is why they're losing their shit right now. Clarify this nine of swords when it comes to this karmic ass energy here. Yep, time is up for that ass. Clock. Needing time cycles and, and takes time to heal progression. Yeah, the time is up when it comes to this karmic. And it's time for this karmic to heal and move forward. Because this divine masculine is not returning. Can I find the Eight of Cups in, in reverse? Yeah. This um, divine masculine is headed towards a new phase. They want to rekindle with the divine femme. And this karmic is mad because they want to rekindle with this divine masculine. They want to rise from the ashes. They're hoping they can change this divine masculine's mind. And, and it's not working. It's not rekindling. They're not getting a new phase. And this is why they're so angry. It's not working. Yeah. This divine masculine is focusing on their self right now. Self-worth and value. They're taking the time to heal. They're doing the shadow work. And they're appreciating themselves at this time. And they are blocking this karmic. Yeah. This karmic wants to take a risk. Take a chance. Not showing their hand, want to take a gamble. But I feel like this, this divine masculine is actually who's blocking. They're blocking this, this karmic. They don't want to take a risk. They're not trying to take no chances. And they no longer want to take a gamble with the karmic. The time is up. It's dead. It's over. Clarify the hermit for this divine masculine and this karmic. Yeah, I told you this divine masculine is ascending. Learning and expansion, transcending, preparing for union, new phase. How was school? Good. Okay. So this divine master is in hermit mode, ascending. Clarify eight of swords. Yeah, they want to come back towards um, this divine fan. This divine master may be a little bit afraid to get back out there. They may be unsure if this divine femme is dating or have met somebody new. But they want to ask this divine femme out on a date. They want to reach out to them online. They may hit you in your DMs or text message you here. Clarify the King of Cups. Yeah, they are reminiscing about this divine femme energy here. Reminiscing, wanting to make memories, learning from the past and changing their perception. Bottom of the deck, a healing heart. Their healing heartbreak, toxicity, or addictions, abusive relationships. This is what they're doing right now in Hermit Mode. They're healing. And they're raising their vibration so that they can come back towards you here. Let's pull this deck. Divine connections. What's going on with this karmic? What's going on with this karmic who is angry here, spirit? When it comes to the divine connections, 
going on with this permit. Also, um, let's talk about the divine masculine energy. Too. There's more karmic energy here, so. What's going on with this karmic energy? That's angry because this divine masculine is no longer giving them the time of day. Uh, Spirit says, do not worry. Divine family, you do not have to worry about this karmic. 101. Caring for your overall health is a necessary tool on your journey. Love yourself a little more today. So do not worry. This divine masculine is learning to love themselves a little bit more. Okay? They are releasing these karmic ass energies. Anything else here, Spirit, when it comes to this karmic? Divine Master, Divine Fem. 555 five, five changes. Your angels are with you during this time of change and transition. Yeah, so this divine masculine is making the changes. They're making the transition. They're not worried anymore about whoever this karmic is. They're done. They're ready for a new beginning here. Hold on. We have 2323. It says tap into the energies of your twin flame connection as a source of creative channeling and expression. So they can be focusing on their creativity at this time. Yeah, because they, they're focused on success. So they're they're trying to find a creative way to come towards Divine Femme. They are trying to focus their energy into creative endeavors as they heal. But they are not, 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 not at all focused on this karmic ass energy. 838, your angels are providing important information to you and your twin on the astral plane. plane. So yes, they are receiving these downloads. While they're in this process of ascending, they're healing and they're having success. They're no longer worried about whoever this karmic is. 0330, this is a green light from the angels. The answer is yes, they're ascending. Yes, they are ascending. Yes, they are working their way back to you here, collective. Clarify this karmic. Your divine masculine is breaking generational curses. Okay? They're healing. They're doing the work. And they're coming towards you for success. Spirit says, do not worry. What's meant for you cannot be blocked by this karmic. Last one. I gave us two. We'll take it. 828. Karmic justice will be served for the highest good of all parties involved. Okay? So karma is going to be served. We're supposed to be served. For the highest good for all parties involved. And we have 1133. Commit to being the best version of yourself. And enjoy the positive impact it has on your connection. And I feel like this is for you both. Divine Femme and Divine Masculine. Commit to being the best version of yourselves. And watch the impact that it has on your connection. It will be success here. Bottom of the deck. 232. Romance yourself as a way of attracting more of this energy into your life. So romance yourself right now, and that's how you call your person in. Okay? So if this resonates with you guys, let me know. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. Until next time, you keep rocking with me. I'm going to keep rocking with you. Love, light, and peace. Mwah! Find my fish. No, TT babies.